as the slogan says, it's always sunny at Centerville. Absolutely perfect conditions for opening day, and the traffic is incredible. With more than 30 rides, there's no shortage of options for kids of all ages. It all depends on what your stomach can handle. It was really fun. I, j I just love spinning around. There's some for little kids, there's some for big kids. It's really fun. Fun is clearly the name of the game at Centerville. Now celebrating its 56th year, it's the longest running amusement park in Toronto. I came here as a kid and now I'm working. My parents brought me and we always get parents, you know, being like, I was on this ride when I was a kid and now I'm bringing my kids and it's, it's always great to see. The parents more than happy to create the same memories for their kids that they experienced when they were younger. I feel like every ride is accessible for them. Uh, nothing is uh, too too aggressive. It's a little bit different. It's a little bit different than Wonderland, also, where you, there's a lot of waiting. Here, so far, there's no lines. It's amazing. To be honest, it's great for the little one. I have a three-year-old, and she's having lots of fun. And it's a beautiful day, so can't complain. And in a world where technology is advancing at breakneck speeds, sometimes kids just want to keep things simple. It's like one of the only normal amusement parks now because there's all these like Universal and like Disney and they're all like motion captured rides. Uh, this like is the one that has like actual original rides like the Ferris wheel, the merry-go-round. Centerville will remain open on weekends throughout the month of May before opening daily on June 3rd. At Centerville, Rob Leth, City News.